People ask us, you know, what are you trying to achieve with Ben's Ranch? What, what is our fundamental goal? And I think if you think and you study young people and the mental health epidemic we're in, you'll see that the underlying issue may be depression or anxiety, but, it, but it's manageable. What is wrecking lives is all the things that come after. And the idea was somewhere we could add to uh, the traditional approaches to teen mental health, which is diagnosis, medication, testing, and often therapy. But we realized that in, off, you know, in so many times that isn't enough. So we were looking for some way to leverage the power of, of outdoors and agriculture and animals. The opportunity to work with these animals and to form a connection, it's just, it's, um, it's just inherent in our DNA to, to bond. I think with the animals and, and that nurturing aspect comes out in a lot of the kids. We complement medicine and counseling and, and good diagnosis. We don't substitute for it or attempt to. We look for farms, for stables, for therapeutic riding centers in the neighborhoods. And then we place uh, these teens there as paid part-time help. Um, they feel like they have responsibility and they do. We ask them to, to show up on time and take responsibility, and they have a, a first, for many of them, first job. They get paid for it, and we make sure they get paid for it. It was just a perfect opportunity for me. I never realized how, uh, you know, kind of hard you'd have to work. Uh, I guess most kids don't realize that until they get their first day. But even though I was comfortable with the idea, I've definitely become more comfortable, and now I just look forward to coming out here every weekend. Uh, seeing the animals, seeing the people, and working hard. I saw the potential to um, connect people to nature, which is something that um, I think is becoming more and more relevant in mental health, um, and more and more relevant in a society that is quickly becoming more technologically involved. This is a constant I can come to and uh, be with people, be with animals, which I love, and you know, work hard. And uh, so it's definitely boosted my attitude, and I. I can't thank well, your organization enough for the opportunity because it helped me. We're not about horses per se or ranches. We're really about getting these kids out and engaging nature. A lot of times if that's an animal, uh, it's even more powerful. We tailor fit that match for each individual uh, and then subjectively keep tabs on their team of people that's wrapping around them, including family, and making sure that it's contributing to their improvement. Have those kids just in recent weeks cutting themselves, uh, talking about suicide, falling out of school, and a few months later having them take me through the barn and say, you know, this is the horse I am in charge of, or one was shearing sheep this summer and, and down at the county fair showing a sheep, you know, and the glow on their face from just suddenly having that injected into their life and getting their hands dirty and, and feeling responsible for another living creature. We need people, we need volunteers, we need donors, you know, we, we need prayers, we need um, advisors uh, and believers to say, you know, we get what you're doing and we want to help.